This is a global issue. We have to adapt our crop to changing climate. You say potato, and Dr. Borle Fofana says potato clothes. So we have different clone of potato here in these bags. He's been conserving this germoplast collection field in Harrington, PEI, for 10 years and just uncovered which genes in diploid potatoes are drought resistant. Each of our trials use different measurements, so some are 10 inches, some are 12 inches. Increasing the genetic diversity between each variety of potato is an effort to conserve biodiversity and make them more tolerant to diseases and environmental stresses like drought. For example, Western Canada, they overproduce potatoes in 2020 compared to PEI because we, we drove hard here and they had irrigation in Western Canada. This is the first year Western Canada surpassed PEI in potato production because of a drought condition. 384 diploid potato clones were evaluated for drought tolerance and plant maturity characteristics. Fofana found genetic DNA markers that were associated with plant growth and had drought resistant characteristics. In case we get years that there isn't quite enough rain. Uh, it's important to have lines of potatoes that we'll be able to continue using and that we won't have to worry about our supply. Breeders could use clones to make future potato varieties more resilient to climate change.